Okay, you lot, let me just start the video, you know, get a, get a promotion out of the way with. Subscribe, leave a like, join the Discord, watch the Five Nights at Freddy's video. It's only four things. If you don't do any one, at least of those four things, when you have a child, if that day ever comes, you know, because, you know, watching this, you might be a Brahalla player. You're already, you know, you've lowered your odds. But I will, I will, I will raise a pit bull named Princess, and I will get it to eat the child. Yeah, and that is, that's not just a threat. Okay, I'll follow through. Uh, but... Point in today's video, only a quick one, is that, fam, I, I, I don't know why I'm, you still see talk, you know, we're, we're in big 2023 now, and I'm still seeing talk of going to Broken, you know, and, 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 and this shit, bro, I just, I, I, I can't subscribe to that, to that uh, hypothesis, to that, to that theory, oh, that was supposed to be a delight, fucking hell, I'm shit at the game, but, it got, bro, I don't know if it's just, no, let me get off hammer as soon as possible. I've just fumbled two D like fucking says, and that is it's a bad omen. I don't know how it's possible to still look at this weapon. I guess potentially in twos, I can maybe see the angle, but especially in ones, bro. Gauntlets are maybe they're not as bad. Uh, you know what I'm saying? As as maybe I'll make it out to be, but they're at the very least just so much less fun than, than they used to be. Like this this weapon used to be so fun, bro, and. I, I can't lie, the, the times where it was most fun were also the times where it was the most broken. So you can't always have, like, you know. What are my inputs today? You know what? I actually don't even blame that on myself. I blame that on the game for, for, for giving, what's it called? Gadgets, priority pickup. No one wants that. I'm trying to pick my weapon back up, you know? I'm not trying to pick up the, the spike ball. Anyway, um, I, this is giving me anxiety, by the way, because I don't know if he's trying to <laughs> set up for a ground pound or, or what's going on. Uh, but... Yeah, it, it's like you can't obviously always have the three piece two combos on Gaunt and all this stuff. It's, it's obviously too broken, right? But bro, the, the dare change has just made dare so much less fun. Like it, it's gotten rid of loops on the weapon. You know, the, the, the constant nerfs the weapon's seen over over time, over the over the years even, is like it's taken away so many guaranteed combos that you would have off of a dodge. And what's fun in this game? Let's keep it real. He's going to throw a weapon and I'm going to dodge it? Okay. You know, I was trying to think a, a little bit too far ahead there. But he is actually terrified to play the game right now, so uh, what an experience. Um, but yeah, well, like that's the most fun thing in this game is catching a dodge on a weapon and just getting 10 million damage off of that, you know? You can still do that off of some bonus dodges. Oh, a perfect example, actually. Uh, but, you know, for the most part, like a lot of shit is just escapable now. And it's, yeah, it's more balanced, I guess. But it's... Oh, it's not fun, man. This actually goes back to that video I made the other day about balance patches and how they've kind of changed the way they do balance in this game, where it's like nothing big happens to balance anymore. It's just small things, right? Because, you know, they, they found a good balance for the game and they're not trying to throw that out of, out of, out of balance, right? Yeah, throw the balance out of balance. But you get what I'm trying to say. You know, they found what works and they're just trying to stick to it. Now, I make, make very minor adjustments. But it does mean we get less broken weapons and less like fun shit I, I don't know i miss old gauntlets though man you can still do cool shit with a weapon you definitely can and it's still like i think the appeal to me of brahala one of the biggest appeals has always been off stage and i mean gauntlets are, are one of the most you know broken off stage weapons right so inherently the weapon is at least by that definition of off stage being fun more fun than a lot of weapons because it, it has such a strong off stick why that shit See, how was D-Light Nair dropping there? I think, maybe, I don't even think that's a new gauntlet. I think that's just me being a fucking regard. <laughs> What's his name? James Charles. <laughs> Why am I you? <laughs> you know what makes that funnier? Is the moment I saw this Loki player named James Charles, I thought of the, the you know, in the, in the teaser. <laughs> you know, in the teaser for this legend, and they just made Loki sound fruity as fuck. Yeah, it makes sense now, actually. Um, but, anyway... Yeah, uh, I, I don't know. I've got honestly not that much to say. I just I just miss the old shit you could do on a lot of weapons in this game because I feel like a lot of weapons, for the sake of balance, so it is a good thing, are just a just a bit drier. Just a bit drier. I mean, I'm basically just saying the same shit I was saying in that uh, video talking about, like, you know, new balance patches and shit. But I don't know. It's, uh, so I guess it's what I've been thinking about in terms of Rahala lately. So can't blame me. Like, what the fuck is that there? Oh, my God. Days, this guy's a demon. Going for that shit. This map, by the way, I will never get over the fact it's impossible to fucking kill on. Um, yeah, I don't know. That, that genuinely, that, that's it for the point of the video. Okay, uh, if you're only here for Brahala, it's fucking time to click off. Um, 
I say that, but it's like, I, I don't know what. He's just dodged the same. I didn't even want to follow up because I thought, fuck, you know. He dodged, he's dodging the same way every time. I feel bad for him. I don't even want to get all the damage because it <laughs> feels like I'm cheating. Come on, man. You know, mix it up a little bit. Um, Yeah, I, well, actually, bro, you know what I was thinking? Yeah? You know those, like, rage bait videos you see on, like, I guess TikTok, if you, you watch TikTok? Uh, for me, I just still see them on Twitter. Whenever I go on Twitter, bro, uh, it's impossible to... Like, even if you try to cut TikTok out of your life and you try to cut, you know, YouTube shorts out of your life, you'll still end up seeing them because at this point, that's, like, the whole internet culture, the whole culture of shit is just based off of, well, you know, short-form content. So, like, it, it just gets reposted fucking everywhere. If you don't see it on TikTok, you'll see it on, you know, YouTube Reels. If you don't see it on YouTube Reels, you'll see it on... on, on YouTube Reels? YouTube Shorts. I was going to say, you don't see it on YouTube Shorts, you'll see it on Instagram Reels. It's... Can he die to a recovery? That would be actually, like, fucking fantastic. There we go. Uh, but you get what I'm saying, right? It's, it's just, you can't fucking escape it. But anyway, I think one of the most popular forms of, of short form content is, is rage bait. Rage bait for, for all, like, the, 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 the brothers who have absolutely no pussy in their life. No clunge. No fucking clunge in their lives. And it, you get what I'm saying? It's those videos of women that are like, you know, well, I, I need a man that makes 400k a month. And it, it, it's like, obviously, no woman actually fucking fit. Bro, there's so many normal women out there in the... <laughs> this guy, he's, he's waking up after literally every single attack. It's just baffling me. But yeah, these brothers that that, that don't go outside, you know, they, they've never they've never lived life. They've never actually even tried to talk to a female. Uh, They, they think that's what, they, you know, they, they live through, through the internet. Right, they live through Twitter, they live through you know, all these all these places. So they actually think that that's just what women are like, bro. That, that is all of them. And they are all like that exactly. And you know what I'm saying? It's it's just not the case, right? But like I said, if you didn't ever go outside, that, that you probably would think that from, from all these like, you know, rage bait, kind of incel bait fucking, you know, videos you see. But yeah, you know what though? I mean, obviously for, for, for it to exist, like it has to exist. There obviously are some people out there some some females out there that would that would be like yeah you know and it's the media ones as well i mean let's be real bro it's, it's the fucking media ones or mid if you need the translation uh that that would be like yeah i know my man needs to make 500k a fucking day you know uh, and then what, what do you offer you know, you know i don't know how to cook you know i don't know how to do any of this shit but you know uh you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a bad bitch. You know, I'm, I'm fucking tenor. So, it, yeah, they exist, obviously, but it's very, very rare. But why are... See, the thing is, right? Bro, I think, you know, listen, I'm making a Rahala video right now, you know? Basically, 100% of, of our brothers watching this are men, okay? And I think we need to understand our, our value, our worth, you know? Why, why do you never see these rage bait videos towards women? Where it's the man saying, you know, I need... I need... I, I, fuck broke bitches, you know what I'm saying? You know, why, why is that not a movement, you know? You know, they, they'll, they'll scream fuck broke brothers all day, but, what, you know, when will when will these men just decide to decide to rise up and turn the tides, flip the tables, you know what I'm saying? Switch the switch and say, fuck it. Fuck broke bitches, you know what I'm saying? I need, I'm, 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 I'm only, bro, I'm, I'm bad, you know what I'm saying? We need, we need, we need these brothers to start standing up, bro, and then say, I'm, I'm a bad bitch. And I need, I need a rich bitch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, what, what, you, well, like why? If that, if, if, if fucking, bro, cause there are, you know what I'm saying? You know, you see the, these pictures sometimes of these fucking wrinkly prune looking fucking old men. And they're with these, with these 10 out of 10 fucking women, bro. It, it's because of money. Okay. You get what I'm saying? And, and, and the women are living for free. You know, they're getting a, they're getting like a, a weekly allowance of, of, of fucking, you know what I'm saying? 50 racks, you know? They've got they've got five houses in, in in you know six different countries. You make that make sense to me, but they do that they can visit anytime because they're with this 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 rich brother. Bro, why are men not doing the same thing? I don't understand. Why don't you find rich women and just just fucking just do the same shit, bro? You know what I mean? You know you know these women are getting flown out to Dubai by these by these fucking you know what I'm saying oil tycoons to to to, to fucking you know what I'm saying defecate on their chests. Bro, what? Why are men not uh, are getting sent out, getting flown out to Dubai, bro, to, to, to suck some toes or, you know what I'm saying, whatever the equivalent is of, of... I mean, it's probably not very equivalent, but you get what I'm saying. Oh, interesting. It's not very equivalent, but you, but you get what I'm saying, bro. I think I think the tide should... I think it's about time, bro. I mean, if you're watching this video right now, you know, don't look for love, okay? 
Just get a bag. That's 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 the moral of the fucking story today. Just get a fucking bag. Honestly, man, catch me. 2024, sucking toes for bills paid. A Porsche. Homes in, in tropical countries. GTA 6. GTA 6 is coming out. I was going to say a, a PlayStation 6, but... You know, that's that's in the future you know i already secured the ps5 so you know i mean i don't i'm not gonna need that um but yeah gta 6 is coming out definitely gonna be in need of that you know and you know why not get it for free you know i'm hearing i'm hearing talk Ooh. uh you know let's let's keep it let's keep it fair let's keep it real on the on the channel you know because <laughs> i feel bad for bro um anyway yeah you know what i, I hope my girlfriend's not watching this video because you know if she is then uh Jesus Christ. Fucking hell, man. I'm finished. Yeah, so. Uh, oh, let me move on. <laughs> Someone asked me uh, in yesterday's video, actually, if I was a, an only child. Uh, yes. Bro, here's the thing with that, though, yeah. I feel like I missed out on so many, like, sibling only stuff. But at the same time, bro, my life would be so much different if, if I was, you know, if I had siblings. Because. My family was was not was far from rich. I'm saying not even middle class. You know, we, we you know went went through it sometimes, bro. If there was two of us, fucking hell, bro, I would have had nothing. I would <laughs> I would have had nothing. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? But I don't know. I, I guess when you're because when you're a sibling, like bro, like playing like games with my sibling or some shit like that, it just sounds like that would have been elite, you know. But I, I don't know. You just you do the same shit when you're an only child. You do the same shit, but just with friends instead. But I, I don't know. I do think it's 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 probably good to to have some have some fucking siblings in your life. Like it just makes life more fun. I think. I mean, it depends, bro. You know, you you can have siblings that are just pricks. But you know, for the most part, I think most people have, especially if they're like around the same age as you. Most people like their siblings, right? Oh, don't fall into that. What are you doing? But yeah, I can't lie. I'm, I'm I'm grateful for it. I think because yeah, you can just have friends. You don't need a sibling. Like it, it was. It probably would have been sick to have like a a brother. But, yeah, I don't know. This, um, I, uh, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't resent my parents for that decision there. Because, you know I'm saying, I got a lot more, like, personal space. You know, I got... There, there was a lot of positives, you know? Um, I mean, bro, there's one massive positive. I don't even... I, right, it's too long of a story to even get into. But, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, I, life worked out well for me uh, in, in one way in particular. And that shit just would not have happened if there was two of us. So, yeah, I mean, um, I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about it, but I don't know. Like, I, I, I'm curious to hear, especially people who are not only children, if they wish they were only children. So I feel like most people with siblings don't wish they were only children. Unless, like I said, bro, you just fucking hate your siblings. And in most cases, I don't think people hate their siblings, you know? So, I don't know. But I'm sure a lot of people who didn't have siblings wish they, they did. So overall, it is probably better for you to have them you know but i don't know like i said i'm i'm not i'm not fucking mad about it uh as you know it's yeah so i feel like i yeah like i said bro most for the most part anyway you don't fucking hate your siblings right you grow up you, you have like a decent relationship with your siblings so so you think like oh bro i couldn't imagine being an only child i would hate to be an only child you know whereas i mean you know there's probably a few people out there who who you know their siblings fucking did raise a pit bull to eat their children or, or something like that and in which case you know they're not, not on the best terms or you know some 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 homophobia in the family or you know one of the siblings is gay and another one is you know a nazi and you know that shit probably doesn't work out either uh but you know for the most part yeah i, I feel like people with siblings would would look down upon only children or not look down upon them but 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 be like oh bro i don't know how you could have could have got through life without, without a brother or a sister or whatever but, I don't know. Well, I feel like, realistically, if I had a sister, well, I, I don't think we'd have much in common, you know? So, I don't know. I feel like I'm more so talking about a brother here. Because, I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm sure, actually, bro, let me not get cancelled. It's 2023, but, you know, when I grew up, I enjoyed playing games, you know, and sports and shit. But, like, more more male-dominated sports and, and more, you get what I'm saying? You don't catch you know, like I said, it was 2023. I'm gonna be careful with my word, words, but you, you you don't catch many fucking females, you know, playing Mortal Kombat or you know fucking Call of Duty or I don't even know what I played as a as a kid. Lego Star Wars. Find me, 
Actually, that one's probably more more realistic, but I don't know. Like, uh, I, I, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's obvious, right? You'd have more in common with a brother if you're a man than you would do with a, with a sister. Well, he just saved me with that weapon throw. Uh, oh, I thought he was a lot more damaged than he was because I thought that shit was going to kill. Hold on. Let's hit something. Let's hit something fucking hard on this map. Oh my days, bro, we actually, wait, wait I, I was nearly him for a second. I, <laughs> I was nearly fucking him. What? But I don't hit shit on this channel. And I nearly just called it as well. I nearly just said, let me hit some shit and then hit some shit, you know? I would have been a fucking, yeah. Well, it's obvious that shit would not happen because that would just be, we'd be breaking out of the fucking the matrix if I actually hit a clip then. But I used to back in the day. I remember I would, oh. If you're an OG, interesting. If you're, if you're an OG to the channel, you remember the the days of intros, right? And I would just feel bad starting my video with some fucking intro, like a like a rectifier. I was it, they were like org intros, right? They were sponsors, and there would be like a little like two second clip, um, just showing the the sponsors logo, and then get into the video. But I felt bad opening it with that, so I always wanted to put something first. So in the videos, I would hit clip, and then I would put that before the logo. Yeah, so the videos would go clip little intro and then the rest of the video and now it's just well, i'm too shit at the game <laughs> but i could probably hit clips but it's just not my place i'm also autopiloting when i play because i'm fucking waffling so much also i forgot to turn it to the fucking thing bro, for a second my heart just dropped because i looked at my my stream labs and i i, I clicked this I, I thought i wasn't fucking recording i thought the video was just not recording i was i was gonna cry Ugh, I hate that shit, bro. I, I will never forget that, that two hour long Jump King video that you lot will never see. Because I recorded it and I played two hours of Jump King, which is not good on the mental, not good not good for the, for the body. And I never pressed record, which then actually, like, obviously blood pressure down here, right? Two hours of Jump King, blood pressure up here, right? And then looking at Streamlabs, looking at your recording software, and realizing, oh, I, I didn't actually press record. Then it skyrockets, not only from the base level, but from the already, you know what I'm saying, near lethal level that it's at at the moment. And then it, yeah, all the way to the roof. Uh, so I did nearly die. But, I'm saying, that's, I'm just a fucking idiot, bro. I fuck up so many videos and you lot will never know because they're fucked up, so you can't see them. <laughs> anyway, let me think of a hint for who's zooming in on in the video there. Fucking waffled a lot today. Okay, hint for who is zooming in on it will be the legend looks like they have just taken a load in the mouth, directly in the mouth, actually. And then let me shout out the channel members Moro, Matt Brandenburg, Eric Sol Cage, John Wild, Pokey Sushi, Fish Six, Dude, Atomon, No Waffles, Ash Mitsin, Kenji, Joker Equest, No Glory, Boggy Bolts, Fatal, Braskari, Dylan and Jelly, Hegemony X9, McD, Red Room, Lighter, Brandon Murray, Maxwell Podcast, Tech with RT, Earthman MC, Pentacle, Slash, Lacan, Atomic Wall, Luzio, Hammy, Awesome, Controller Mods, Andy Nocturne, Kane, Luca, Dodge Dolphin, Captain Law, I came J. Drunk Dog Chilled, Alex Ephemia, Beyond the Matthew Wise, Violet Genesis, Muaz, Mystic, Danny Boy, and Toby the God. I mean, yeah, bro, it's it's crazy. I mean, thank you all so much. I apologize that I've not been streaming lately because, yeah. Um, I, well, I have. Just It's been like every other day instead of every day. Uh, I've just been waking up late. I've been getting awful sleep this week, but I'll get back into it. I'm low-key getting bored of Mario Galaxy as well. I, you know what? Next time I stream, next morning I stream, I will wake up. I will go sit on my, on my fucking dusty gaming chair. And I'll boot up Five Nights at Freddy's 4 and stream that for you lot, okay? That's that's the promise. Next next stream will be that. And I'll try and fucking get through that game. But it's not gonna be it's not gonna be good. Anyway, uh thank you though, all the channel members. You helped me out a lot and you know that, so I'm very grateful. Everyone else, leave a like, subscribe, shut up, have a great day, pussy, and peace.